in this class we are going to uh, discuss a problem related to decimal equivalent of binary number given see the problem here find the decimal equivalent of binary number 11011011.1101 this is a very big binary digits they given to convert into decimal so uh, the problem is double one so double one zero double one zero double one point double one zero one this is the binary number given to convert into x decimal that x value we need to consider so uh, here this is this will comes under any other number system to decimal just keep in mind like anti division you need to consider that means multiplication of uh, digits with two power place values you need to consider anti division you just treat like multiplication this just like a shortcut i am giving so here uh, the place values uh, to consider the place values if the binary number is having decimal digit then uh, decimal after digits the place value starts from minus 1 from left to right it will goes on increasing from uh, left to right that means so minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and minus 4 like this in the same way point before digits the place value starts from 0 and uh, it goes on increasing from right to left that means 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 like this now after giving place values our aim is to multiply digits with two power place values now i am taking first digit 1 into 2 power minus 4 place value of that one is equivalent to minus 4 now plus second digit into your base is 2 2 power place value is minus 3 plus 1 into 2 power your place value for this one is minus 2 plus 1 into 2 power place value of this one is minus 1 every time you need to consider the base 2 why because you are converting base 2 to 10 so to convert any base to 10 processes like this the base will change for example here you, if you are having octal 8 power we will take uh, the procedure is same so now so we completed point after digits and coming to point before digits 1 into 2 power the place value of this one is 0 plus 1 into 2 power place value of this one is 1 plus and 0 into 2 square plus 1 into 2 cube plus this 1 into 2 power 4 plus 0 into 2 power 5 plus 1 into 2 power 6 plus last one into the place value of that last one is 2 power 7. So now this is equal into 2 power minus 4 that means 1 by 16. So here 0 into anything 0. So 1 into 2 power minus 2 that means here 1 by 4 plus this is 1 by 2 plus 1 into 2 power 0 means this is equal into 1 plus so 2 power 1 means so this is equal into 2 so here you are having 0 0 into anything you are having 0 plus 1 into 2 cube this is 8 plus here you are having 16 2 power 4 means 16 plus you are having 0 into anything means 0 plus 1 into 2 power 6 means this is 64 plus 2 power 7 means 128 you know the value of 1 by 16 so that 1 by 16 value is nearly equivalent to 0 0.062 0 0.0062 say and your 1 by 4 value is so nearly this 1 by 4 value is 0 0.25 and you know your value of 1 by 2 that is 0 0.5 by adding all this you are going to get nearly 219.81 like that so this is the answer for this conversion so like this you need to convert the binary into uh, your decimal but 
will you do this procedure for gate means no you are not going to do this procedure whenever uh, descriptive exams are there then you need to consider this procedure when uh, you are uh, attending for gate like technical exams so time is a major issue you can't do all these multiplications and you can't take that calcis and everything so here you just place uh, digits that means so here this is uh, uh, this is uh, one and uh, this is 2 and this is 4 and this is 8 you need to consider all 2 powers that is it 2 power 0, 2 power 1, 2 square, 2 power uh, 4, uh, 2 cube and 2 power 4 means 16 and 32 and 64 and 128 up to 2 power 7 right. So now you can see where you are having 1's where you are having 1's means so you are having 1 here and 1 here and one here that once you just add 128 plus 64 plus 16 plus 8 plus 2 plus 1 will give you 219 coming to here you here you need to do 0 0.5 and 0 0.25 0 0.125 0 0.0625 0 like that you are having values here you just add that values so you just add these values and you just add these values where you are having once then you will get the same value that is a uh, one uh, half minute issue if you want to do this procedure it will take nearly 5 minutes um, in gate like exams that 4 or 5 minutes also calculated and when you are having this type of conversions better go for 2 powers in case of binary to decimal conversion in octal to decimal or hexa to decimal definitely you need to go for this procedure or other ways there I will tell you later so here in binary to decimal conversion either this or 2 powers you need to consider and you need to add where you are having once then it will give you the same value.